So, uh, I can remember him telling me a number of stories about how my father kind of took him under his wing and was telling him how to stand for something and not fall for anything. And this particular person, when I tell you, when he stands for something, he never falls for anything. He, he, he goes all the way from the beginning to the end. And this gentleman is uh, like a brother to me. And I commend him in the community work that he has done. Uh, he is definitely following in his mother's footsteps, who was the first uh, black woman to work under the hub of the sheriff's department, and also a very sweet woman. Uh, his family and my family were very close, still are, along with my family here in Charlotte. Uh, and I just think that for him to be out there on the forefront at uh, maybe the age he is now, still. <laughs> I, 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 I don't want to tell our age. But anyway, I think that this award, the Velma Rucker Community Service Award, is definitely overdue to my brother, Ernest Rucker. from the Jumpstart Community Training and Services. And he's a great support to us. So I want you to continue on. Just don't beat people up on the way. Continue to be <laughs> humble, because you know I gotta keep bringing them back. Just continue to be humble and follow your heart. Okay? Thank you so much. Thank you for being you. I just want everybody to know this is nothing new. This is everything.